the Windows operating system has never been great for customization. Thankfully, there are programs that can help you to tweak and customize Windows to suit your needs. Today, I will show you five cool software that provide you with additional tools to improve your overall experience on your Windows computer. This will include software to enhance the layout of your desktop and programs that keep your stuff better organized. Coming up next on Tech Gumbo. First up is RainMeter, which is a free and open source program that displays customizable skins on your desktop. There are thousands to choose from in various categories that display the time and date, weather, RSS feeds, system monitors, skins that control your media, and many others. There are several websites that offer a large collection of skins that can be downloaded, including Reddit and Lifehacker. My preferred site to download new skins is DeviantArt which has one of the largest collections of skins, with new ones being added each day. Of course, you should know by now to be cautious of anything you download from the internet and to scan with your favorite security software. In the several years I've been downloading skins from this site, I've never had any issues. One of my favorite skins is called Enigma, which has been around for many years and is quite popular with Rainmeter users. The time and weather skin in the center of the screen is called Simploni. If you right-click anywhere on a skin, you have several choices. If there's another variant of the skin you selected, if available, it would be listed here. To add new skins as part of this suite, select Sidebar or Taskbar to see your options. I'll go down to Process and select this one. Once it shows up on your screen, you can click and drag it wherever you want it. The newest stable release to RainMeter is compatible with Microsoft Windows 7 through 10. If you're feeling adventurous, they also have a beta release that you can check out. But for most of you, I'd recommend that you use the 4.1 final release. For organizing your desktop shortcuts and folders, Fences is the most useful program that you can use. It works in a similar way that the group feature does on Android, but with more customization options. It couldn't be any easier to use. Just left click and draw a rectangle on your desktop. Then choose Create Fence here. Give your new fence a name. I'll call this one Browsers. Then hit Enter. Drag the fence where you want it. My shortcuts are on another monitor, so I'll select the ones I want in this fence and drag them over. It looks like this fence is not big enough. You can also click the edges and corners to resize the fences to make everything fit. Once they're in the fence, they won't leave unless you remove them. They'll even stay inside the fence when you update the drivers for your graphics card. Right-clicking inside of any fence and choosing Configure Fences will give you several customization settings that you can change. But I've always found that the default settings for most of these work pretty good, so I usually don't make a lot of changes. With all the cool features that Microsoft has added to Windows in the last few years, I'm surprised they haven't added something like this yet. For organizational freaks like me, Fences is must-have software. If you can't wait for Microsoft to add this feature, Fences is available for Windows 7, 8, and 10, and has a one-time cost of $9.99. If you want to try it out, they do offer an unlimited 30-day free trial. Folder Marker allows you to add color or change the icons for your Windows folders. It's especially useful for getting more organized, especially if you're working on a large project with a ton of folders. I'll demonstrate with folders that I have on my desktop. Just right click the folder that you want to change. Move your cursor down to Mark Folder. You have several choices, including changing the priority status of that folder. For this one, I'll select High Priority. And it added an arrow up icon to that folder. Changing the color is just as easy. I'll select another folder, same as before, right click, and go down to Mark Folder, and then move your cursor down to Colors, and then select the color that you want for that folder. I'll make this one green. As you can see, it couldn't be any easier to use. Folder Marker is available for free on Windows XP through 10. They also offer paid editions with additional features, but for most people, the free edition will be all that they ever need. Next up is Flux which is a must-have program that reduces eye strain. It's especially useful for those of you that use your computer most of the day. 
It also decreases the blue light from your monitor, which can make you sleep better. If you have Windows 10, there's a nightlight built in, but the settings they allow you to change is very limited. With Flux, setting your location in the lower right will automatically set a night mode from dusk until dawn, so you're not looking at an overly bright screen at night. Screen recording software won't capture this, but if you move the slider, you can adjust the daytime color. Selecting the menu bar in the upper left gives you several settings that you can change, including adjusting both the day and night colors together, along with other features and options. It's best when you start using this program to use the default settings and adjust as needed. Flux is completely free and works on just about every version of Windows. If you also run Linux or Mac, you can use it on those operating systems as well. Window Blinds is another cool program from the makers of Fences, which I showed you earlier. This program allows you to set custom skins for the Windows operating system, changing the taskbar, start panel, window frames, along with other changes. Installing new styles is simple. Several are included to try out. I've opened a few programs so you can see the before and after. Right now, it's set to the default theme for Windows. Select a new style. I'll go with this one called Acrylic 7. Then select Apply Style to Desktop. Then it takes about 30 seconds for the changes to take effect. When it's done, you'll see that it gave the taskbar and open windows a brand new look. Just like Rainmeter, there's an entire community devoted to creating new skins at Wing Customize with more than 600 to choose from. Most are free, but some do cost money. A free one I've been looking at is called Ninja. This one looks pretty cool. I might have to install this one later on. Window Blinds is available for Windows 7, 8, and 10. Just like Fences, the one-time cost is $9.99, and they do offer a 30-day free trial to test it out. Thanks for watching. All links are in the description. Give this video a thumbs up if it was useful for you. If you use another program not mentioned that helps you to stay organized, productive, or just changes the look of your desktop, let me know in the comments. If you're new to this channel, subscribe and click the bell icon for more cool software and other tech-related stuff from Tech Gumbo.